It's a beautiful day for remote learning, a beautiful day for a lesson. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? It's a studently day in this beauty wood, a studently day for a lesson. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? I have always wanted to have a student just like you. I've always wanted to teach in a classroom with you. So let's make the most of this beautiful day. Since we're together, might as well say, would you be mine? Could you be mine? Won't you be my student? Won't you please? Won't you please? Please won't you be my student? Hi everyone, welcome back to Miss Nichols' Neighborhood. It's me, your teacher, Miss Nichol. I'm here with my here. best remote teaching helper, my sister Kaylee Nichol. Hello. Hi guys. We're back today. It's a new day, meaning we are doing new weather tracking. We are checking to see if March really does come in like a lion and goes out like a lamb. Now, Kaylee and I are going to get ready to go outside and see if today has lion weather, meaning it's raining, windy, really cold, or snowy. I don't think it will snow here in Los Angeles, but never know. <laughs> and, or we'll see if it's lamb weather, breezy, cloudy, sunny, rainbow weather. If you're able to track your weather just by looking outside your window or maybe whenever you're with your family, if you're able to track the weather or just check the weather, go ahead and be thinking if it's lion or lamb weather where you live. Now, Kayla and I are going to go outside and we'll describe to you what it's like for us here in Miss Nichols' neighborhood. <laughs> okay, everyone, we're outside now. We're here trying to check the weather. Let's go ahead, look around, see and feel what the weather feels like outside, Kaylee. Hmm. What color is the sky looking like right now? Blue. Blue skies. What color clouds do you see? That cloud over there, what color is it? White. White clouds, that's good. Do you feel and see some sunshine coming on us? Yeah. Yeah, my eyes are starting to water. It's super bright outside. <laughs> and I definitely feel a breeze today, yeah. But it still feels pretty nice outside, right? Yeah. yeah. So, does that mean, is it more of a lion or a lamb weather day? I got the key. A lamb weather day, yes! Yeah. Because it's sunny, some white clouds, a breeze, but it's not a lion day because there's no rain, it's not super cold, there's certainly no snow. So I think you're right, Kaylee, it's definitely a lamb weather day. Let's head back inside so we can track it on our calendar. We're back inside. We saw how outside where we live in Miss Nichols' neighborhood and tracking in the morning, just barely afternoon, we saw sunshine, right, Kaylee? Yeah. Did we see white clouds? Duh. Yeah. Did we feel definitely a little bit of a breeze? Yeah. Yeah. So it seems like we were having lots of lamb weather. So what was the weather like outside today, Kaylee? It's okay. Like lamb weather, yes. Yeah. And it's okay if when you track your weather, maybe it's lion weather where you live, or maybe the weather changes during the day, and that's totally okay. But for us, Kaylee and I, where we live, and how we're tracking the weather right now, it does happen to be lamb weather. So we're going to go ahead and take our tracking piece. If you're tracking at home, that's awesome. Kaylee already has another lamb piece ready for us. So we're going to mark on our calendars how today, Friday, March 27th, is another lamb weather day. Do you have that piece for us, Kaylee? Okay. Nice job adding it to our calendar. 
Wow! Since we started tracking last week, we've had one, two lion weather days. But let's see how many lamb weather days we've had. We've had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven lamb weather days. So have we had more lion or lamb weather days? Which one have we had more of? Cape. Yeah, we've had more of the lamb weather day. Because just two lion, but seven lamb weather days? Seven, we know, is the bigger or larger number. So we've had a lot more lamb weather day. As March continues to end, we're only going to track the next Monday and Tuesday, just two more days, the last two days of March. We'll have to see if March really does end with lamb weather or maybe has a few more lion days. It's going to be interesting to see. I hope everyone has a great lamb weather day, a great weekend, and we'll be back on Monday to track the last two days of March. Exciting to see. Kaylee's excited because then it's April and her birthday comes very soon. Yay! Have a great day and weekend, everyone. Bye. Bye-bye. Yeah, yeah.